You can travel all around the world riding on your little bicycle. You cross rivers, climb up the mountains, and you meet so many friends. Mook, mook, from Arctic to Canada to forest in Alaska. Mook, mook, can you tell me what you see? Mook, mook, exploring Madagascar and the sand in Sahara. Mook, mook, tell me, tell me what you see. Tell me, tell me what you see. Tell me, tell me what you see. Hockey. For ages, Meat, I'm starting to get a cramp. Hi, Popo and Meeta. Mook, Chabapa. Oh, no, Popo, you can't move. Whoops, are we oh. disturbing you? I'm finishing my first work of art, but it's not easy with Popo as a model. We went on a visit to the art gallery and now Meeta wants to be a painter. You'll like this, then. We met an artist today. Really? What does he make? Stuff like this. And he helped us finish our game of ice hockey. Hockey? You've been playing ice hockey? I love that game! Ho ho! <laughs> What's hockey got to do with your artist? You'll see. Mook, tell him the story. We're in Canada, staying in our friends Abby and Taddy's village. We were in the middle of a game of ice hockey. Over here, Taddy! Pass it to me! Chabapad dribbles the puck and heads towards the goal. But Abby comes up to tackle oh. him. Oh, hey, that doesn't count. I skidded. Rook, over to you. Oh. Are you OK, Mook? I'm fine, but my stick isn't. Hmm, we can't fix that. And we haven't got a spare stick either. I'm sorry. Don't worry, it was an accident. And it's not your fault if you're too strong. What about the rest of the game? What do we do now? I could try and play with this. But how are you going to play like that? <laughs> you look like a skating frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Hey, not bad. Hey, that's not how you play ice hockey. Ribbit, ribbit. <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny. Hey, Mook, pass it, pass it. Oh, oh, whoa. I feel dizzy. Oh, ah. I knew it. We'll never be able to finish the game now. Wait a moment. I've got an idea. Yeah, go on, Mook. Oh, that's not how you play ice hockey either. Moo, pass it to me. <laughs> Sorry, that doesn't count, does it? Impressive, Mook. Yeah, well, a broom is for sweeping, not for playing ice hockey. <laughs> You're right. I'll never be a champion player with this. <laughs> <laughs> that's it, a champion. We can go and see Oki. Oki? Oki is a sculptor. We know him well. He was a champion ice hockey player. Really? You know a real ice hockey champion? I always wanted to meet one. Maybe he can lend us a hockey stick. That would be great. And much better than a broom. Oh. <laughs> Come on, his workshop isn't far. Whoa! I'm going to meet a real champion ice hockey player. Whoa! Ah! One of Oki's sculptures. He made it out of a tree trunk. 
Poor Boo Boo. I hope Chavapa didn't give you too much of a fright. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe your new friend knows where we might find Oki. We'll ask him. Do you know where Oki's gone? In the forest? OK, thanks. Huh? But how? Daddy saw that Oki's sled isn't here. He always takes it when he goes to collect wood in the forest. <laughs> Hi, kids. Oh, it looks like we have visitors. These are our friends, Mook and Chavapa. They're cycling round the world. Well, travellers are you, and hockey players too, by the looks of things. Yes, and we're so pleased to meet Ooh. you, a real-life hockey champion. Oh, uh, thank you. And we need you for our game. Oh, uh, you know I haven't played for a long <laughs> time. I'm a bit rusty. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you can still play really well. But we're not looking for another player. No, we're looking for a new hockey stick. Mook broke his and we can't finish the game without it and... You were wondering if I had one I could lend you. Oh, yes, please. That would be great. Have you got one? A real champion ice hockey player stick? Maybe. But first, I need a team to help me find some more wood. We're, we're right, right here. here. So... The stick you're going to lend Mook, is it the stick you used when you were a champion player? <laughs> and what colour is it? Is it heavy? Hey, look at this! A caribou antler! The caribou lose their antlers in the winter and they make really beautiful sculptures. How many matches did you win with it? Uh, did You're you? a champion at asking questions, aren't you? Who? Me? Do you think so? <laughs> Is that OK, Oki? It's not quite right. It's good wood, though. We'll keep it. But we should try and find more. You're in a hurry to leave, aren't you, Chavapa? Well, don't you want to see this hockey stick, too? I can't wait! Oh! Perfect! So, can we go now then? Yes, we can go now. Yahoo! We better hurry up! <laughs> I've got enough to sculpt with for a while now. Thank you for all your help. No problem! There's nothing like team spirit! Oki must have won lots of matches. Look at all these cups! <laughs> Those are red cups! I love boiled eggs. This is the hockey stick I used in competitions. Wow! That's great! A competition stick! I knew it! Uh, play with that. You'll play like a pro, Mook. It'll be tricky, though. That stick is much too big and heavy for you to use. How will you be able to help us, then? By doing what the first ice hockey players did. They sculpted their own hockey sticks. Is that going to be my hockey stick? This? No, it will make a perfect coat rack. But we can't play hockey with a coat rack. Indeed, but this piece of wood will be perfect. There you are, young man. Wow! It's perfect! Thank you, Oki. Thanks, Thanks Oki! Bye! See you soon! Bye! Have fun! OK, everybody, let's finish the game. <laughs> You still playing the same game? OK! And his hockey stick! A competition one! Is there room for an old player? 
Of course! It's Oki and me against all of you! Let's see how good this new stick is, then. Then let's go! Who won the game, then? Uh, we were having so much fun we forgot to keep score. Can we take a closer look at your new stick, Mook? Whoa! That really is great! Yeah, it's a work of art. Hey, will you show us your work of art, Mita? Of course! <gasps> I thought you'd finished! Yeah, the cactus! Don't worry, there's still room for you. Look, get in position and I'll keep going. No! What if I do the washing up for three days? Four. Two. Hmm, OK. Be strong, Popo. Call us back when it's finished. Yeah, see you next week. <laughs> <laughs> Travel all around the world Riding on your little bicycle You cross rivers, climb up the mountains And you meet so many friends Mook, mook From Arctic to Canada To forest in Alaska Mook, mook Can you tell me what you see? Mook, mook Borealis. <coughs> At last, it's Popo and Mita. Oh no, it's all dark. Happy birthday to Chumapa! Thanks, you two. <laughs> what are the torches for? We're pretending to be a laser light show with lights that spin around to music. We went to see one today. Wow, your lights look like the Aurora Borealis. Aurora what? Aurora Borealis. We saw the most amazing light show today. Is that what the Aurora Borealis are? Please tell us. Well, we're in Lapland near the North Pole, staying with our friends Aki and Aku. Mook! Come quick! Oh, what is it? Aki and Aku have gone. They've left without us. And they promised us a mystery walk, remember? Hmm? Oh, oh. Yeah. Mook, today's a special day, though, isn't it? They could have waited for us. Yes, but Chavapa, yesterday you said you didn't like walking far. Oh. Don't huh? worry. I haven't forgotten. <coughs> Happy birthday, Chavapa! Thanks, Mook. And it's your birthday all day. So you can open your present when they get back. We'll think oh. of something to do until then. Huh? Uh, do you really think I need to wait for them? They didn't wait for us, did they? But Aku and Aki and I chose a special present for you together, so you can't open it until the twins are here. <laughs> hmm. Hey! <coughs> You're not looking for your present, are you? No, no, I'm not in any hurry to find it. Chavapa, no! I only want to look at it. I won't open it. Can I open it, please? Chavapa. I'll just have a quick look. <sighs> oh, hiking equipment. What? What are you talking about? Flashlights, snowshoes for walking, and this looks like a blanket. What's this, a joke? Great! Thanks, Mook. I love it. We'd better put it all back in the box and wait for the twins. Wait, Chavapa. I don't understand. Huh? That's not what we bought you. There must have been a mix-up in the shop. It doesn't matter. We'll just take it all back. You wait out here, Chavapa. Otherwise, you'll find out what your present is. Ugh, first no mystery walk, and now a present that isn't really my present. What's going on? I'm going to find out. Hello. Hmm? I'm only looking. I'm not listening. That's my friend Chavapa, the most curious person I know. 
I don't understand what happened, but it's not the present we got for him. I know. You've bought me a skidoo, haven't you? Or a CD of Joey singing, that's it. La, 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 la. Or maybe a scarf. Better than that, you've bought me a Sammy costume. I'd love one of those. No, sorry, none of this came from my shop. I don't sell any of those things. There must be some clue. Uh, oh, come on, Chavava. Look, whistles. How strange. Oh. Hey, what's this? I don't know. A map. The twins must have drawn it. Look, it shows a path out of the village. Then a little wood. And look, there, across, by a red hut. The twins must have planned it all. It's like a puzzle. I bet they took your present too. Are you sure? You'll find out if you go. Huh? It's not very far, just the other side of the hill. The master map reader is off to find his present. Let's go. So, what is my present, Mook? Give me the first letter. Go on. You don't give up, do you? You'll get your present later. If the twins took it with them, of course. Oh. Huh? Huh? This is easy. We just keep following the path. Hmm. Come on. Hey, Mook, look at that. That must be the twins' hut. Come on, we'll cut across here. Uh, are you sure? Look at the map. The hut's in the middle of the forest, not at the edge. I'm sure. We just need to follow the tracks. It's a much quicker way to the hut and my present. Whoa! <laughs> oh. <laughs> <Yoo -hoo! laughs> <Yeah>. Whoops! <Yoo -hoo! laughs> oh? Uh, you were right. This isn't the twins' hut. Perfect. It's out. Time to go. Oh! You scared me! <laughs> I'm Adka, the forest ranger. Who are you? Hello, I'm Mook, and this is my friend Chavapa. We're looking for a red hut. Have you seen one? Aha! Uh -huh. Are you looking for the red mocky? Yes, that's it. Ah, I see. You're going the wrong way. You needed to stay on the path. Don't worry, it's easy. The path is just over there. Would you like me to take you? On a skidoo? Ah. Thank you, but it's a challenge that the twins set us, so... Hmm. And you want to do it on your own. I understand. I'll just point you in the right direction and then I'd better get going. I've got lots more work to do and it'll be dark soon. Already? Yes. The days are very short here as we're so close to the North Pole. Ah, I see you're well equipped. The path is a hundred yards that way. A hundred yards? Great. That's not far. Come on, Mook. One. Two, Thanks, Atka. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, seventy-eight, seventy-nine, eighty, eighty-one, ninety-four, ninety-five, ninety-six, ninety-seven, ninety-eight, ninety-nine, a hundred! Yes! There it is! Atka was right. It does get dark early here. Which way do we go, right or left? Wait, there's something strange written on the map here. Look, there's a whistle, then equals, and a light bulb. It's like a clue we need to work out. I've got my whistle. at our whistles. Whistle with me again, Mook. It must be the twins. They're over there. Over here, Mook. Chavapa, we've been looking out for you. You took ages. Come in. Yeah, well, we had to look around before it got dark. Happy birthday, Chavapa. Wow. Did you do all this for me? Yes, 
But the hardest part was to get you to come to our Moki. Well, you did in the end, and it really was a mystery walk. And it's difficult to keep anything a mystery with Chavapa. Who can that be? Hello, Atka. Hi, Aki. I was just passing to check that Mook and Chavapa found their way here. Yeah, they're here. I'm glad you're here, too. Huh? Do you think they brought it? Oh? Wow! Candles and cake! And my present! <gasps> Happy birthday, Chavapa! <laughs> oh. oh! A Sami costume, just what I wanted. Thank you, everyone. We're not the only ones who wanted to give you a present, Chavapa. Oh, really? Who else does? Give me a clue. Go on, just the first letter. <laughs> Be patient, Chavapa. Has everyone got their flashlight and blanket? Yes. Mm -hmm. Great. Follow me outside, then. We haven't got far to go. If you're looking for your present, it's above your head. Huh? Whoa! That's some birthday present. It's magical. These are the Aurora Borealis. It's a natural occurrence. They light up the winter nights in Lapland. Happy, Happy birthday, Chavapa! We've already done this. <sighs> oh, no. It wasn't another birthday surprise for me. No, just a power cut. <laughs> 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 Maple syrup. Mm. Mm. That was yummy. Mm. Hi, hi, Popo. Popo. Hi, Mita. Hi, Mook. Hi, Chavapa. We're eating pancakes and we thought of you. We wanted to say hello. We made them ourselves. They're the best. That's only because you haven't tried our maple syrup tart yet. It's a Canadian speciality. Maple syrup tart? Mmm, that sounds delicious. We harvested it ourselves. We're now experts at making maple syrup. And tasting it. We're really good at that. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Tell us! Well, we were in Canada with our friend Abby and we'd just been out skiing. It's the best way to see the beautiful snowy countryside. Wow, that was great! Thanks, Abby. Yeah, but it's hungry work. I think I need a snack. I've got an idea. Why don't we make a maple syrup tart? Oh, oh yes. yes! To make the tart, we need flour, eggs, cream, butter and, of course, maple syrup. Oh, no! There isn't any! So we can't make it, then? Uh, yes. We can go to the maple grove where my dad works. He'll give us some maple syrup. Hey, Abby, can I have a go at mushing? Huh? At what? <laughs> Mushing. Driving the dog sled. Oh, right. Sure. Only if I get to go on your skidoo. Yahoo! Let's go! Come on, dogs. We're off. Huh? Huh? You need to be more firm, Mook. Listen. Go! <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.
scissors are much better. OK, OK, but they're really easy to drive. You can go just as fast on a sled. Really? Go, Tunga! Go, Dalawi! <laughs> tubes for? They take the maple water from the tree to the sap house. But there's something wrong. Dad? Hi, kids. I'm in a hurry. The main tube is damaged. I've had to stop the pumps while I go and buy another one. Maybe we can help you. Good idea. We can start harvesting the traditional way. OK. That's really kind. See you later. Uh, what's the traditional way of harvesting? By hand. By hand? Yes, look. This is the modern automated way. See those trees with the buckets over there? That's the traditional way of harvesting maple syrup. Wait, I'll show you. Here. The idea is to take the full buckets and replace them with empty ones. Oh, OK, that's easy. Come on, it's this way. Past the modern maple grove. Wow, it's a long way. Which tree shall I do? You can start with whichever one you like. We've got to do them all. It's best to start with the trees at the back. Mm. There are so many. Just think of the delicious tart we'll have later. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> well done, Moog. Not a drop spilled. On to the next one, then. We could work together if you like. You take the full buckets off and I'll put the empty ones on. Hmm, OK, good idea. Abby, what do we do now? We need to take all the full buckets to the sap house, then bring them back when they're empty. Wait, can I have a taste first? I need some energy. But it doesn't taste like anything. <laughs> of course, it's maple water, not syrup. Be patient, you'll soon see. Come on, back we go. I get the feeling this isn't going to be easy. Yeah, yeah, it's really slippery. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> oh! Watch out for the buckets, Trevor Park! Yeah, yeah, that's all I'm doing! Ta-da! Well done. Well handled. You were right, Chavapa. It's not easy. Back we go! I can't move any further. Oof. We can take a break if you like. Yes, please. Can you tell us how the syrup's made? Good idea. Come and see. First, we put the maple water in this big pot. We heat it up to get rid of the water. The syrup is left and we filter it into the smaller pot. Do you want a taste? Yes, please. We cool the maple syrup down in the snow. Awesome! Wow! It's like a lollipop! Mmm! 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 Mm. That's delicious! Have a taste, Mook! Ah! Oh, I feel better now. Let's get back then. We've nearly finished. Maybe we could find another way to carry the buckets more easily. The two sledges here! 
Are you holding on to it tight? Yes, I am. Huh? Stop! The buggers are wobbling. You need to wedge them with snow to stop them moving. It's OK. We can go now. Not too fast, Mook. Careful, Abby. What's wrong? The bucket! <laughs> Delawe! Tonga! Quietly now! That's enough! Back to the sled! That was close! They're sweet, but very playful. The squirrel just has to show its face. Oh. Oh. My feet are freezing! I'm stopping! Come on, Chamapa! Think of that delicious tart Abby's going to make us! <laughs> <laughs> There's so much going backwards and forwards. We're never going to finish. We do have to go a very long way round. It would be much quicker if we could cut through the new maple grove. If we undid some of the tubes, we could get through. Uh, OK, but we have to put everything back afterwards. Don't worry, I'll take care of it. doing puzzles. Switch it back on. Wow! It works! That's a much easier way. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Your maple syrup tart looks really good. Oh, it is. Actually, can I have some more, please? Hey, what about us? Can you send us a slice in the post? <laughs> 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 we'll email you the recipe. Then you can practice. And when we get back, we'll taste your maple syrup tart to see if they're as good as Abby's. Mm, I'm sure they'll be as good as our pancakes. Yeah, they do look good. Would you like us to post you some? <laughs> 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 Popometer answer! Hi, Mook and Jabba! Ah. Where were you? We were ringing and ringing. We were finishing our packing. We're going skiing! I hope you've got your scarves, gloves and hats. Yes! Jabba, why are you wearing that huge scarf? Are you ill? I've got a cold. Uh, 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 choo! <laughs> and it's all the scarf you <clears throat> sent me's fault. Huh? What are you talking about? I'll tell you. We were in Canada, in the frozen Northern Territory. Oh, it 
it sure is cold. Shh. Hmm? Oh. Ah. Ah. Hey, oh. my scarf. Huh? Ha ha! A caribou wearing a scarf. Ha 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 ha! Hey, wait! Come back, my scarf. Ha ha ha! That's really funny. It's not funny at all. Popo and Mita gave me that scarf. It's my favourite. Quick, Chavaba, we need to catch up with them. I think you can say goodbye to your scarf now. Oh, no, no, I have to get it back. Hmm? Hello. Oh. oh. You look like you're lost. Can I help you? No, uh, we're not lost. We're travelling around the world. But you can definitely help us. We're looking for a caribou. He took his scarf. A caribou taking a scarf? I've never seen that before. Well, he didn't actually take it. The wind blew it. And you want to get it back? Oh, yes. I'd love to help. I'm Abby, by the way. I'm Mook, and this is my friend, Javaha. Uh... <laughs> Amazing! If we wait long enough, we might even see some beavers. Hurry up, Chavapa. We need to keep up with Abby. Come on, Moog. Cute little beavers. Just two minutes. Huh? <laughs> Want to race? Yeah, let's go. Watch out, Abby. Coming through. <laughs> Of snow. Aha! Uh -huh. Because caribou's hooves are a special shape. It stops them from sinking. So if we follow the tracks, we can find them. It looks like the caribou's are heading towards my village. Oh no! Now what do we do? Which way do we go? I think we'd better give up. You're never going to see your scarf again. All right, then. Can we go <gasps> back to the beaver dam now? We can ask my father huh? where the caribou have gone. He'll know. Follow me. Here we go again. <laughs> Dad! Hi, Abby. Hi, huh? Daddy. These are my new friends, Mook and Chavapa. Hi. Your dad? 
Dad told me to tell you that he's gone to the sugar barn. Oh. He'll be back later. Oh, dear. I was hoping he'd help us find a herd of caribou. There's one that got my scarf caught in its antlers. <laughs> huh? I saw it. It was heading for the waterfall with the rest of the herd. Where's the waterfall? Oh, no. Let's have a rest first. Can't we just get another scarf? Look at Abby's scarf. It's really nice. <laughs> my grandmother knits them. She'll make you one if you like. But this one was a present from one of our friends and I really like it. He won't give up. The waterfall's not very far away. We can all go. Wait there for a moment. I'll be back. Come on, Chavaba. Let's go. Here we go again. Where's he gone? Huh? Uh, I don't know. We're never going to get my scarf back, are we? OK, everybody. I'm ready. Let's go. What's all that? Aha! It's a surprise. OK, let's go. We need to walk the last bit. We don't want to frighten the caribou. Shh! Listen, what can you hear? The wind? Beavers! <laughs> no, it's the sound of the caribou hooves. Uh, and what's that strange noise? The caribou again. We need to walk really quietly if we want to see them. when the ground is frozen. Caribou love it. Huh? Go on. Wow!
of milking a yak. La, 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 Hi, Jabba Pa. Hi, Mook. Hi, Mita. Where's Popo? And what's that strange noise? Shh. Popo has to sing in the school concert. But he's very nervous. Can you tell him he'll be fine? La, la, la. It's going to be a disaster. Yeah. Huh? If you sing like that... Chirpa! Uh, sorry, Popo. It just didn't sound like singing. You're right, Chavapa. What am I going to do? Don't worry, Popo. You never know what you can do until you try. You may find you have a hidden talent, like Chavapa and I. Really? So what are your hidden talents? Let me tell them. We're staying with a friend called Pasang and her family on the Tibetan Plateau. And today, Pasang was going to take us on a trip into the mountains. <sighs> Hello. I'm sorry. I can't show you any sights today. I'm very busy. <coughs> wow. He's quite a sight himself. <laughs> he's a she. This is my yak, Pugga. Every week I have to take some of her milk to my Uncle Dawa in the next village. I like that snuffly sound she makes. You know how to milk a yak? Yes. Would either of you like to try milking her? Um, Mook will do it. All right, I'll give it a try. Like this. Gently, but firmly. It looks fun. Your turn. All right then, Pagga. Oh! I think it's your gloves, Mook. They're too cold. <laughs> OK, Chavapa. You'll see it's not so easy when it's your turn. Well, uh, I don't think so. Whoever milks Pugger gets the first drink of yak milk. <laughs> milk? Mmm, yummy. OK. It can't be that hard. There. Nice and warm. Did you see that, Mook? I did it! Ah! Yum! It's even more delicious when you've milked it yourself. Chavapa, can you help me, please? What are those for? It's a leather bag for carrying milk. There! Uncle Darwa needs it by the end of the afternoon. Would you like to come with me? Yes, of course we'll come. Um, I think Chavapa really likes your milk, Pasang. We'll all have some milk when we get to Darwa's. Let's go! Come on! Is it far? Yes, quite a long way. Oh, good. I can have a little sleep in the cart then. Whoa! Oh! The wheel! The milk! Uh, oh, no! I have to get this milk to my uncle. He really needs it. Don't worry. We've got our own wheels. On our bikes? Oh, great. Good one, Mook. I've got an old bike I can use, too. But we really have to hurry. Chalapa, hurry up. I'm coming. <sighs> Paga, I'll see you soon, my friend. Is it OK? Is it well attached? Yeah, don't worry. It's fine. You know, we've carried all sorts of things on our bikes. Djembe drums, a scooter engine, a mailbag, a giant basket, a piñata, cakes, big boxes, a chicken. No, I carried the chicken. There's a bit of a climb, then it's downhill. Don't worry, we'll be fine. <laughs> Are you OK, Jabba Yes! <sighs> Up there! There's a temple! Can we go and see it? Now? No, we haven't got time! It won't be long! He always says that. There's never any stopping him. Wow! It must have taken them so long to do all these wood carvings. It is amazing! Yes, but we need to go now. Come on, Chavapa. We'll get down a lot faster than we came up. Sure. <laughs> Please be careful with the milk. It's very important. Don't worry, Pasang. Yoo-hoo! Oh, maybe we 
We'd better use our brakes now, Mook. You can use your brakes if you like. Oh! Whoa! Oh, Mook, are you OK? No problem, I'm fine. What about the milk? The milk? Uh -oh. oh no! Catch it quick! Quick, quick! Like a goat skin. It must belong to someone. Oh, Chanso, Delic, you found it. Thanks. Hey, Pastang. Uh, is it okay? It's not too damaged. No, no, don't worry. The bag's still full. It was lucky you were here. Thank you so much. No, no problem. problem. We'd better get going. Bye. Okay. okay. Bye, Pastang. See you, Chanso. Bye. Thanks again. Here we are, my uncle's village. Hello, Uncle Dawa. My dear Passat. Uncle Dawa, these are my friends, Mook and Chubbapa. Hello. Very pleased to meet you. I was starting to wonder where my milk had got to. It's here. I milked it. It's really fresh. Huh? Hey, Mook. Huh? What's wrong, Chavapa? There's something wrong with this milk. Oh, dear. Wow. We're so sorry, Dawa. Yes, there are bits in the milk. <laughs> <laughs> it was a rather bumpy journey, Uncle Dawa. Why are you smiling? We've spoiled your milk. Not at all. Yak milk is so rich and fat it can be churned into yak butter. And that's what you've done. You've sloshed it around huh? so much you've nearly made it into butter. That's butter, then? No, it's cream. But you've done half the job. I'll finish it later. But why do you need so much milk, Uncle Dower? You'll see. Wait for me. I'll put this away and I'll show you. I'd rather drink milk than eat butter. Here we are. Follow me. Here's some butter I made yesterday. Is it far? No, we're here. Hi, Indira. Dawa, hello. You've brought some more butter, thank you. Ah, creamy but firm. You've done a great job, Dawa. Thanks, Indira. But wait till you see the one I'll bring you tomorrow. For this one, I had a little help from Persang and her friends, Mook and Chavapa. Ah, thank you. Do you really eat this much butter? <laughs> oh, I'm not going to eat it. I leave it to go sour. <laughs> <laughs> and then we make a sculpture. Just like these ones. Wow! wow! A dragon! These are made of butter? Yes. First I colour the butter using a dye. Then I mould it with my hands. Like modelling clay. Would you like to try? <laughs> I've always been told not to play with my food. Come on, Mook. First, we put our hands in ice water so the butter doesn't melt. My turn. Whoa! Ooh, that's chilly. <laughs> <laughs> See, Chawapa, it's good to have cold hands sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you going to make? I'm going to make a flower. I'm doing a dragon. What about you, Mook? A yak. And I'm going to make tea. Would you like to try a yak butter tea? Uh, no, no, no. I think I prefer fresh yak milk, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I'd have liked to taste yak butter tea. Me too. It was kind of Indira to let you make butter sculptures. Can we see them? Yes, here's my yak. Wow, that's great. What about you, Chavapa? Uh, I didn't have time to finish my dragon. I only made the eye. It sounds like you had a great adventure, but how's it going to help me at the school concert? Well, I had a hidden talent for milking yaks, and we both had a hidden talent for sculpting butter. So maybe you've got a hidden talent for singing. Let's hear you, Popo. Uh... Go for it, Popo! OK. <coughs> Alouette, gentille alouette, alouette, je te plume Hear that, Popo? 
Gaga likes it. And so do we. <laughs> <laughs> Giants. Hi, friends. Oh, pull harder. Oh. Pull harder. It's nearly off. Uh, 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 Thanks, Mook. Mook? Chavapa, are you OK? We're great. Thanks, Popo. Mm. Guess where we are. Uh, 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 mm, somewhere really cold. The North Pole? Almost. We're in Canada, in Inuit country. There's so much snow, it comes up to our knees. Really? Did you build a snowman? No, but we did see some giants. What? Huh? Giants? Go on, Mook. Tell them. Our friend Amaruk invited us to stay with him in Nunavik, in a beautiful village. Near the North Pole. Look, there's Amaruk's village. Great. When we get there, we can have a rest and warm up. Not just yet, Chavapa. Amaruk's taking us fishing, remember? I know, but I didn't think we'd go right away. My parents, a Tata. Hi, kids. And a Nana. Hi. How was your trip? It was good, but a bit cold, and uh, my trousers are all wet. Uh, 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 Bless you. Don't worry. I've got everything you need to keep you both warm as well. That's much better. It all fits like a glove. Ready for a fun fishing trip then? I've got everything we need. Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Bless you. Let's go then. Bye bye. See you later. Have fun, kids. Be home in time for supper. Yes, Mum. Do you do a lot of fishing? Yes, I go every weekend with my dad. Hey, that's Yumi Mag. Hi, Hi Yumi Mag. Mag. Hi, kids. Enjoy your walk. He's going fishing in the sea, but it's a long way from the village. Really? Where are we going then? We'll try the pond first. Everything's white here, Amaruk. It's beautiful. And flat. You won't catch me. You won't catch me. is the ice flow. We usually have to be careful, but the ice is so thick here, we can skate on it safely. Woohoo! This is great! Try it, Chavapa! My father and the other fishermen always leave a little pile of stones by their favourite fishing spots. Like that, over there? Yes, we're here. Ah! Oh, look! There's already a hole here, huh? Oh, it's cold. Here, one each. They're much better for catching fish than with hands. Do you 
often come fishing here. Yeah. Shh. You'll scare the fish away. Maybe, but there might not be any fish here today. That's because you're making so much noise. <laughs> <laughs> All the fish have definitely been scared of now. <laughs> <laughs> There's another place my father likes to fish, but it's much further on. Oh, wait, wait, I've caught something. Whoa! Oh. Hmm. Shall we try this other fishing place then? OK, but we have to hurry. We want to be back in time for supper. How do you know your way out of here? Everything is white and looks the same. Have you got a map? We don't need a map when we have Inuksuk. Inu what? Inuksuk, a large pile of stones. The Inuits build them to help them find their way. Like the stones by the fishing holes. Yes, but much bigger. Look, there's one. Whoa! Whoa. Wow, it's huge! It looks like a stone giant. So it does. Mr Giant, can you tell us where to find the best fishing place? Yes, small huh? little people. Follow the direction of my arm. You'll huh? find another Inuksuk. <laughs> 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 Thanks for your help, Mr Giant. See you later. <laughs> mm. I'm going to be fast. <laughs> <laughs> We'd better hurry up before Chavapa scares all the fish away. <laughs> Here, fishy, fishy. Come on, swim into the nice net. <laughs> Aha! I've got one. Oh, look at that. Mmm, yum. Let's catch some more. Yahoo! I've got one. I've got one. Me too. Two, three, four. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, four. Oh, oh, five. What a good catch! Mmm, we're gonna have a great dinner. Yeah, that's for sure. Uh oh, it's getting foggy. We need to get back home and fast. Oh no, we're gonna get lost. Don't worry, Chavapa. Look there! We could follow our footprints back. Oh no! Oh no! There are footprints everywhere! Now what do we do? I don't know. And I still can't see any Inuksuk. It's this way! I remember seeing that big mound that looks like a mound. There are lots of mounds of snow here, Chavapa. Uh, well, yes. Um, uh, oh, yeah. Uh, let's keep going. We'll try this way for a bit. Oh, bet you it snows soon. We can't see anything in this fog already. Oh, look! Over there! I can see something. Maybe it's another Inuk, um, Inuk, Inuk, in. An Inuksuk. But, uh, Inuksuks don't normally move, do they? Maybe it's a, a, a real giant! Ah! <laughs> do you think the giant saw us? Ah, 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 Shush! Or the giant will spot us! Well, uh, but there aren't really any giants here. It must have been a polar bear. Uh, is that supposed to make us feel better? Whatever it is. It's still coming towards us. Ah, it's coming! We need to throw it a fish to distract it. Throw another one, just to be sure. Hey, it's the pointy-headed Inuksuk. Is he going to scare the bear away? No, silly. It's showing us the way back. It's that way. Ah, over there! Ah! See the village! We're nearly home! But we've only got one fish! 
fish left! Oh, oh, oh. Hey, good idea! So then, did you catch anything? Yeah, we caught some huge fish! Uh-huh, but then a giant came! An enormous polar bear! Who chased us? It would have definitely eaten us! I've never seen anything like it before! <laughs> <laughs> Me neither! I've never seen anything like it before! Ah, there it is! The bear! It rained fish today! You mean Mag? And our fish! So, you aren't a polar bear? Me? A bear? <laughs> <laughs> Did you eat the fish together? Yes. Was it good? Delicious. Javapa ate lots and lots. Of course I did. I've got a giant's appetite. Uh, 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 you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who needs to put his warm boots back on? <laughs> <laughs>